Investors have raised concerns about the current inflation rate, which is higher than the interest rate on the Treasury bills. The 91-day and 182-day Treasury rates are currently below the rate of inflation, which is almost, almost 14%. But the director of the Institute for Statistical, Social and Economic Research, ISA at the University of Ghana, Professor Peter Quarter, says the situation will correct itself. Yes, um, but I think this will self-correct uh, because um, no investor would invest at a rate below, uh, with a return below the rate of inflation. Um, and the uh, inflation rate we are seeing is a monthly inflation. So um, because we are reactive, we, we tend to look at, uh, we are adaptive in the sense that when we see the rate of inflation, then we also revise our expectations for how much the banks would offer. So if, for instance, I have an investment with a bank that is giving me 13% on treasure bills, and I realize inflation is now 13.9, I may disinvest and ask for higher rates. So that's the point I was making, that it will self-correct. Certainly, um, the interest rate would have to be slightly higher than the rate of inflation. Otherwise, why would you invest? It's better off keeping the money provided it is in a safe area. But that does not promote financial intermediation. So ideally, we need to put it in the bank and ensure that it's circulating. But you do so when you realize that the, your, your real, uh, the real value of your money doesn't fall if you should invest.